Hi friends. I'm Arma Saeed and you're watching, What Does COVID-19 Do To Your Body? on Kingdom Information, YouTube channel. This is the second video of this series. Please like this video and subscribe the channel for latest stories, updates and articles on daily basis. At this point, we should all follow the best practices to avoid COVID-19 wash your hands, practice physical alertness, stay at home when possible, but what happens when you come into contact with the virus? Because COVID-19 is still new and there is a lot more to learn, here is a general review of the effects it can have on your body. From that time on, we know that COVID-19 is transmitted through the gotcha line of water sprayed from the nose or mouth. If an infectious person stings or flushes, another person can fight the virus by directly touching the gotchalin or touching a surface on which the gotchalin is applied and subsequently touching their eyes, mouth or nose. Once the virus enters the body, it begins to invade the cells that line the nasal cavity and neck. For the most severe cases of COVID-19, this is what causes the virus. When the virus starts to take over and damage the healthy cell, symptoms can start to appear under the form of headache, neck pain or toss. At this point, your body will recognize that it is experiencing something abnormal and will lose a generic immune response to create an odd environment which can lead to fever. In time, the immune system becomes more sensitive to the virus and becomes accustomed to creating specific antibodies to contrast it. This phase lasts about five to seven days and for many people the COVID-19 infusion ends here. In some cases of COVID-19, the virus travels to pulmonium, provoking vomiting and polemics. The virus infects two types of pollen cells, calciform cells, which produce mucus, and worm cells, which prevent pollen from absorbing debris, such as pollen, pollen and batteries. When these healthy cells become dehydrated and disrupted, the pores can become inflamed and absorb liquids and debris, making breathing difficult. It may take several weeks to recover from this type of viral polio, but most of it occurs within a week or two. For a small percentage of people, COVID-19 can be critical or deadly. As the immune system seeks to fight the virus, it increases the production of white blood cells, which can penetrate into polymers. Contaminated by debris, liquids and white globes, the polymers appear to be superficial and unable to perform their normal functions. At this point, patients require the assistance of a ventilator and their polemics cannot provide solitary respiration. In more critical cases, battery infections can include an already undetermined immune system, leading to organ insufficiency and death. Because these symptoms and the inertia surrounding COVID-19 can be serious, following the public health guidelines is the best thing you can do to protect yourself and others from fighting the virus. Continue to do your part and we can beat COVID-19 together. I hope you enjoyed the video of what does COVID-19 do to your body. In upcoming video you will get to know what happens when you get the COVID-19 vaccine. Thanks a lot for watching the Kingdom Information YouTube channel. Please like this video and subscribe the channel for useful videos on daily basis.